Here we have to find the numbers a, b in order to make this function continuous at every point on the intervals. So um, start off with a quick sketch. So here is your graph. And you have a piece for x less than negative 4. You have this piece over here. And for x greater than 3, you have this constant 21 over here. And you have open circles at the ends of each of those. So what we need is we need a line segment that joins these up perfectly. This is what we need. And it has closed dots right there. So we need this. So we need to find the equation of that. So our requirements over here are that f of negative 4, actually when you're at negative 4, the f value better be negative 7. Otherwise it's not going to join up on the left. And similarly, f of 3 better be 21. Otherwise, it's not going to join up on the right. So that means that you have a times negative 4 plus b has to equal negative 7. And a times 3 plus b has to equal 21. It's a system of two equations, two variables. You clean it up a little bit. You solve it using your algebra 1. And you come up with a equals 4 and b equals 9. So the line segment is part of this line, y equals 4x plus 9. And I entered it into the calculator and got this picture right here. And it perfectly joined up the two ends.